Mega towers are mega stupid. Sutton Place residents came out this week trying to halt the construction of a 67-story luxury building that would rise nearly 800 feet. Putting a giant tower in this neighborhood is like dressing a little baby in a black leather jacket. It just doesn't fit. The well-heeled residents of this east side neighborhood hope to stop the building with an unusual and controversial rezoning plan that they're now trying to push through the City Planning Commission. Their proposal would cap most building heights at 210 and 235 feet, roughly no taller than 18 stories, in a new special zoning district. Buildings that include some affordable housing could be slightly taller. Some residents of the nearly 500-foot-tall Sovereign, home to super-rich people like Donald Trump Jr., are leading the sophisticated campaign. Local elected officials have signed on to the idea. I think every New Yorker is tired of super tall buildings going in that have no place in residential neighborhoods. And for the first time, residents have banded together and fought back. Critics insist local residents just want to protect their views and that the proposed limit would set a bad precedent of allowing small, well-to-do neighborhoods to carve out exceptions to broader zoning plans. You'd basically thwart development throughout the city. Any single residence, any single building or enclave could stop uh, construction. The head of the City Planning Commission claims the group's plan to limit building heights actually would lead to the creation of less, not more affordable housing, as the group claims. The proposal would effectively be a downzoning, discouraging the production of even market rate housing which in turn makes affordable housing creation less likely. City planning hasn't yet said when it will vote on the proposal, but it is likely to happen this summer. In Sutton Place, Michael Scotto, New York One.